today we're going to talk about a tool that you can use to help you with your rhythm when you're practicing. It's called a metronome. So I am at a website right now called metronomeonline.com. And if you need to see the words separated, they're right here, metronomeonline.com. And this is a site that works on all of your Chromebooks. So you could find this link in Bookmark It. Um, also, you could find metronome apps on any iPhone or Android or Kindle device. There's a lot of them and many, many, many free ones. So you don't have to pay for it. But today I'll use this website just because you can use it on your Chromebook. So you see this circle and you see there's numbers all around and a number in the middle. The number refers to how many beats per minute you would play your song. So you're going to hear a click when I push on start and the number is how many clicks would happen in a minute. So here is 92. And if that number is lower, so I'll just go to 52. It's slower. And if the number is higher, then it's faster. So the trick is finding a steady beat that works for you. I'm going to start with 66 beats per minute. And I'm going to play the song Allegro along with this beats per minute. So I'm going to play it using the viola notes. So violin players, you might know a different version of the song, but you the rhythms are exactly the same. So first I'm going to listen to this beat. And we're going to count off with it. One, two, three, four. my quarter notes, my do's, go along with that steady beat. If I'm playing do days, do day, do day, do day, do day. If I had half notes, do, do. Right? So I'm going to do that first line of Allegro one more time. So I listen to that beat. I count it off. One, two, three, four. Okay, so let's say that that was pretty easy. I would bump it up. This time I'm gonna bump it up to, that was pretty easy, so I'm gonna bump it up two clicks. So now I'm at 72. So now I think one, two, three, four. my beat was slightly faster, but it was still steady with the metronome. I'm going to bump it up a lot now. I'm going to bump it up to 100. Okay, I'm listening to the beat. I'm going to count off. One, two, three, four. So notice even though my beat was faster, my do's and do days stay the same. Do, 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 day, do, day, do, do. So that's how you use a metronome. Make sure that when you're using a metronome that you're choosing a speed that's right for you, right? If I'm first learning a song, I'm not gonna go like that. That's crazy, right? Um, so just make sure that you're choosing a speed that's right for you and that you count off along with it so that you match your speed to the metronome.